begin tonight with breaking news regarding Trip Halstead. Fox 5 News has learned that the seven-year-old has passed away. More than five years after suffering a serious brain injuries, it was October of 2012 when a tree limb fell on him outside a daycare center. Good evening, I'm Tom Haynes. The news broke just a couple of hours ago, and News Edge's Marissa Mitchell is here now with heartbreaking details on the story. Marissa? Tom, the agonizing announcement came about an hour ago, and according to a Facebook page his parents have, Tripp was having difficulty breathing this morning, and paramedics took him to the emergency room in Athens. Doctors there sent him to Children's Healthcare of Atlanta at Eggleston. Tripp's story starts a little more than five years ago when a limb fell on him outside of his daycare center. He suffered severe brain injuries and spent months at the hospital. Millions of people locally and around the world follow Tripp's tale as he fought to get better. When we caught up with the Halsteads back in October, his mom told us he was using a new sit to stand in his mobility chair and his family said he was making good progress. Over the past few months though, Tripp has had several setbacks, but the entire time his family held on to hope he would improve. On his family's Facebook page today, his mom, mom Stacy Halstead, said doctors thought Tripp's left lung was cloudy and he possibly had pneumonia. But tonight, we learned he took a turn for the worse and passed away at Children's Healthcare of Atlanta. Now, a lot of you are talking about the loss of little Tripp tonight, and we've set up a post on the Fox 5 Atlanta Facebook page where you can leave a message for the Halstead family. We'll keep you updated as to any memorial plans for Tripp Halstead. Tom. Now, that family has been through so much, and our heart goes out to them tonight. Marissa, thanks.